Hi, my name is Darshi and I'm here to give the demo of the new Android application called Voice Grocery List. As the name suggests, Voice Grocery List is a voice-enabled grocery list app which will let you enter text using voice instead of typing it and also speaks back to you. Let's take a look. To create a new grocery list, tap on the menu and then New List. To enter the grocery list name, you can use either the keyboard or tap on the microphone button and talk when prompted. Weekly Safeway List Alright, in this screen you can create aisles and grocery items within aisles. For example, let's create two more aisles. Fruits and Vegetables Bakery Now let's create grocery items within the aisles Tomatoes one pound One head of lettuce French garlic bread Blue and pink toothbrushes Blue and pink toothbrushes Grocery list is ready. It's that simple. Now when you get to your grocery store, all you need to do is open up your list. And when you pick an item in your list, you can check that off by doing a long touch and choosing the strike off option. Also, you can ask the app to read out all the pending items in the aisle by long touching options. If you are too busy and don't have time to strike off or interact with the app, you can go to the simple list which looks pretty much like a list of items in a post-it note. Now if the list you use today happens to be the weekly list, you won't need to enter it next time. You can mark this list as a template and use this to generate new list in your next week. Let me show you. All you need to do is Now if you try to create a new list, you will see the weekly Safeway list you just marked as a template in the list of templates here. Safeway list for December 31st. There you go. There are a few more cool features I would like to show you. First of all, the apps come with a bunch of templates for the popular grocery stores.
You can see that the aisles are ordered in the same order in which it is laid out in the store. This will help in optimizing your shopping experience. Also in the list you created, you can rearrange the aisle in the order you would like. Let's take a look. For instance, let's open Safeway list for December 31st. Now if you do a long touch, you will get all kinds of options to move the aisles around. For instance, let's move Misc aisle all the way to the bottom. Another feature I would like to show you is how to undo strike off on all the items in your list. Now if you would like to share this list with someone else, you can always send the list as an email. See, it creates a nicely formatted email for you. If you have any questions, everything is listed in the help option in the menu. Now, let's take a look at how to back up your grocery list and also restore from the backup. Before you do a backup, make sure your phone is not connected to the PC or you are not running any application that actively uses the SD card. To do a backup, go to settings and then hit the backup button. That's it, the backup is done. Usually the backup will take only a few seconds, like you just saw. If you have more data, it will take more time. Now, let us see the file in which the data was backed up. Here you can see the file that I just backed up. The file name itself contains the date and time of the backup. You can do backup multiple times and all those files will show up as a list. See, we have two backup files now. You can also copy these files to your PC. Let us see how to restore the data from the backup files. Choose the backup file. That's it. Restore is done. As easy as that. Now, you might have thought of some cool features you would like to add to the voice grocery list application. You can suggest the feature through the app itself like this. Fill out this email and send it to airversoft at gmail.com. We will consider all requests for future releases of this application. Thanks for watching.